I had this BBC micro bit uh, on pre-order from Pimeroni and uh, so I put an order in some weeks ago and it's just arrived. I thought I'd share the unpacking experience. So, so basically we've got a small instruction leaflet. We have a safety guide and this tiny brown paper package uh, which contains the micro bit. So let's have a look. There we are. So this is the first commercial BBC micro bit that I've seen. Um, I've got one here from uh, that was very kindly given to me by the IET, the Institute of Engineering Technology, which is my professional body. So this one you see has got a red red flash in the corner, and this one is green. Um, and really extremely similar. So uh, I just wanted to share that. So the, so the commercial shipping units of the micro bit are now available. So on the Pimeroni website, um, it's still described as pre-order. Um, and I think this did take about three to four weeks to arrive. Um, but it is possible possible to now buy commercial units. Um, the price of this unit, this was £13 including VAT. I had to pay a little bit more for, for postage and packing as well. Um, so that's the, the commercial price now, £13. Uh, let's just quickly power it up and see what software is in here. Oh yeah, so it's preloaded with some demonstration software. Some simple things to get you started with the BBC Microbit. Uh, just have a look at this leaflet. So the leaflet has got some instructions how to get started and a few a few web websites to connect to uh, in order to check out some sample programs. I'm just having a look at one of the links that's been supplied on the little pamphlet that came with the microbit. So if I go to aka.ms slash microbit I end up on this um, Microsoft site here code the microbit.com and um, this looks quite interesting because it's uh, this looks similar to the standard microbit uh, BBC hosted website but it's actually slightly different um, so let me just demonstrate uh, so here you see there's a, a block system so you can write programs as a block and that looks a bit like the standard microbit site but if we click on here we do show code underneath here we see JavaScript so this is actually programming the micro bit in in JavaScript which is a little bit different to what you get on the micro bit site so um, let me just compile this program and I'll load it into my micro bit okay so my micro bits plugged in there 
and I'll compile this code. It says uploading. It's opening. Oh yeah, it is loading with little yellow lights flashing. And there we go. So the flashing smiley face is on the micro bit. So that's quite nice. Um, yeah, so I'll experiment with that a bit because uh, this allows you to write programs in JavaScript, which is another alternative to the blocks language or uh, MicroPython or the Microsoft Touch Develop. And um, so it's, it's interesting to have more choices, really. Okay, so I'll go into this in more depth um, at another time, but that's, that was the first look at my new commercial micro bit.